first technique that is required for blue belt is turning the handle. This is, can either be an offensive motion or a for a punch. We're going to use it off of a punch. So you're going to start from your fighting stance. This one is what we call Chinese swings. The first one is a left. It could be a back knuckle to the face or the initial block. The right hand will come in with a forward knuckle to the face. At the same time, your right foot is going to sweep their leg. And then you're going to do a double back knuckle to the body as you pivot back into fighting stance. Again, turning the handle from a fighting stance. Chinese swings. Right foot. Double back knuckle. Turn and back into fighting stance. From this position. Start from your fighting stance. Sweep the foot. Double back knuckles. These should be big circular swings and pivot back to the fighting stance. Again, big swings, almost like figure eight motions is what you're doing here. All the way through and no stopping. And turn. Again, from here, Chinese swing, sweep the leg, double back knuckle, pivot around. Again, now when you sweep this foot, you want to sweep right around the Achilles tendon, not too much higher than that, or you won't get to work right, and you want to be in pretty tight with your opponent. So these are swings, can be blocks or strikes. Sweep the foot, get them off balance, and pivot out. That's turning the handle. Okay, the first technique that's required for Tracy's Kempo is turning the handle. This can either be an offensive motion or a left punch. We teach it as a left punch. So your opponent has their punch out and their left arm and their left leg forward for this technique. So just for, for practice purposes, I'm going to go ahead and have him put it in position. And then I'll show you how it would work normally. So just put your punch out. Right, so the person's thrown the punch. Now they can either be throwing it from a left lead or they step in and through it, however you want to practice. So what we're going to do is you're going to take your right foot and Chinese swings. Now Chinese swings are big, long, extended blocks. So this will act as a block. The first one would be the block. And then the second one would be your strike. So what you're going to do is you're going to take your right foot as you do your Chinese swings, and you're going to come out, and you want to catch it right behind the tendon so the foot just slips. And then back fist strike. Okay, so we'll have him start with his left leg back. Right, and I'm in my fighting stance. He steps forward. As he steps in his punches, this is going to block the punch. This will come in and strike as we take the leg, and then a double back fist and turn around into fighting stance. Again, so we're here, he steps in, punch, block, strike, kick, back fist, and turn around. Okay, from a different angle. Okay, they step in. Remember, this will be the initial block, this one will be the strike. These are big swings. So we come in, kick, back fist, whatever you can get a hold of on the body, and pivot around. Last time for turning the handle. So they take our stances, they step in, one, back fist, and turn. That's turning the handle.